Hello everyone, how are you guys doing? This is Marco here. I hope you're all doing well and I hope you also enjoyed that beginning clip there. I think that's the first ever time I've actually got a really good combo. And I mean, I mainly play solo, so obviously I don't have that communication with teammates. And I think me and my teammate pulled off an amazing combo there. It was like a three-way pass combo and I, I thought I'd put that up at the beginning because I, I actually, when I got that I was freaking out a little bit. I know it's not good compared to what some of the things you see on YouTube but for me, I mean I'm just a casual player, that is decent for me. So anyway, I hope you guys are kicking off to a good season and I'm not going to lie, I've actually kicked off to a good start. I was at gold rank last, last season but now the new season's kicked off, I'm literally platinum uh, division three. I'm literally, I'd say, about two games away from going into diamonds, uh, diamond rank, which is obviously one rank away from the rank we all want to be in. <laughs> um, and I mean, I was actually talking to someone about this. And do you guys reckon that grandmaster is actually, I mean, a, a realistic achievement? Do you think that it is possible to achieve that just being a casual player? Or do you think you have to put in hours and hours of work? Let me know what you think in the comment section because I personally think it is achievable. Now, I'm I'm basically in Diamond and my goal is to basically go into uh, get into Grandmaster by the end of middle next year. I mean, who knows? I mean, I'm going to try. But I mean, as I said last season, I couldn't even get out of Diamond. So, uh, Platinum. I mean, I wish I couldn't get out of Diamond. But yeah, I mean, let me know what, uh, what rank you guys are in. And also, if any of you play on PS4... Let me know in the comment section because at the moment I'm just playing solo and I think to get into Grandmaster I think you do need to play with a teammate. Especially now, I mean, the, the rank I'm in, there's people putting parties now and I think that's what I need to start doing. I need to start getting in parties because I feel like I'm go if I'm going against people that have that advantage of communication, I'm losing. Uh, them games I mean the only games I'm winning are the games that everyone's playing solo and they're just partying up with someone random but yeah if you guys play on PS4 let me know in the comment section and maybe we can do some partying up and maybe we can uh, we can smash some online Rocket League together <laughs> the main reason why I've had a good start is because my you know you get your unranked games you got to do 10 games before you get put into a rank I, I actually won most of them and that put me straight into diamond uh, not I keep saying diamond, man. I need to stop saying it. I'm platinum, not diamond. I got into platinum division three straight away off the bat, which was a really good start for me. And if you guys, if some of you guys haven't already played your unranked games, I would suggest not playing them. I would get warmed up and then take them as seriously as you can because I think they're the most important games. If you do well on them, you will be put into a, a really good rank straight to begin with and a good division. If you don't do well on them, then that's that could that could potentially give you a bad start, and then you have to grind to get to where you were. And I feel like them games are the make or break games. Them ten unranked games. If you do well on them, then you're due to a good start. And hope I've, I've done good on them, and now I'm due to a good start. I mean, I don't really play this game as much. I'll say I put if I play it a day, I'll put about an hour or two hours into it a day. So I mean. If I wanted to get into Grandmaster, I would have to do some, some more hours a day into this. And, I mean, if anyone watching this video is in Grandmaster, let me know in the comment section. I mean, I'd love to know how you got there. Now, obviously, I know, we, you know we've got pros on YouTube that are in it, and they're in it every season. I mean, I know they're, they're in it because they're pros, but I wonder about casual people. I mean, do you think us casuals have got a chance in getting into Grandmaster? I mean, I honestly think we have. And I think it does take a lot of grinding though, and I don't know if I'm up to the commitment of doing all of that. Especially now we've got Call of Duty World War 2 around the corner. And if you know my channel, you know my channel's based around Rocket League and Call of Duty mainly. And now that's around the corner, I don't know if I'll be playing this game as much. I'll definitely be playing it, but I don't know whether it'll be as much as Call of Duty. Because you know when a new game comes out, you'll get fixated on that game and then you won't go back to your old game as much. But I mean, I'm hoping to play this just as much. And I mean, I'm really enjoying it. I'm not sure whether to stick to 2v2 or maybe try 3v3 out. But I mean, I don't know, 3v3 is really hectic. Um, I've tried it a few times and I just I'm, I don't like it at all. I feel like there's too much going on and it's not very tactical based. I mean, you've always got someone in goal and then, I don't know, I just don't like it. I feel like it is too much, there's too much going on. But I mean, I've played it before. I don't mind it in casual when you're partied up and you're having a laugh with your mates, but other than that, I don't I don't play it competitively. I just play 2v2. 
but yeah anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video this was just a little catch up and you know just a little conversation discussion with you guys and if you did enjoy the video i really appreciate a like and if you're new then make sure to subscribe for more rocket league videos and yeah i'll catch you guys out in another video stay safe and i'll see you guys later